our first lecture and since 2019. So welcome everybody back to our club. What's up, El Segundo? Welcome to the 2022 Community Service Awards sponsored by the El Segundo Rotary Club. This annual event honors those members in the community who have achieved the highest level of recognition in their respective fields, and we're about to find out who's being honored this year. Our Rotary Club's been holding the Community Service Award event for the, approximately the last 30 years. Uh, this is the first time we're back here for this event after the absence from COVID for the last two years. The motto of Rotary is service above self. And I think our city employees and our school district employees demonstrate services above self. So it is our honor to honor them once a year. It's a wonderful opportunity for the community to come together, say thank you to those who uh, were achieving the uh, top honor in their uh, said positions. So today we're going to be handing each one of the uh, awards recipients uh, like a certificate of accomplishment, a thank you per se, from City Hall and the City Council saying thank you for everything they do for this community. To have people in the community highlight our employees and um, recognize them for the good work that they do for the city, for the department, for our community is fantastic. Well, I am very proud personally, and I can speak for the entire fire department that we are all proud of Captain Tony Del Castillo, that this award is very well deserved. He's a very hard worker. Um, he leads by example. He's an excellent captain and supervisor. I can't see, say enough about him. We're here today to celebrate our employees um, of the year for the service awards. We're recognizing school employees as well as city employees and police and fire employees. This is a great way for us to recognize the people that go above and beyond for our community. We talked to several of the honorees at this year's Community Service Awards. Uh, the most rewarding part of my job um, is actually when I get to go into the community and provide a service and help uh, people within the community that are having probably one of their single most worst days. That is the most rewarding uh, to me and that's why I chose this career. It feels amazing to be the teacher of the year and wisdom is always ask questions, always wonder and always stay curious. Two of our honorees were absent this year. Susie Flores, Classified Employee of the Year. She works at El Segundo Middle School. Also, Officer Dominic Fix Gonzalez, who won Police Officer of the Year. I feel so happy winning this award. It means a lot to me. I want to give a big thank you note to El Segundo Police Department. They're like my family to me. What motivates you to be the very best at what you do? Yeah, I come from you know a, a punk and DIY background, and it's really about getting down to the roots and making things better. You know, if you think of gardening, unless the roots are really strong, the top isn't going to grow. And that's what I really like about my job is I get to get into the roots and I get to get with people, and we get to make our place better. The 2022 Community Service Awards have come to an end with the El Segundo Rotary Club honoring and recognizing six well-deserving city employees for their dedication and service to their community. Also, a very special thank. Thank you to the Zimmerman Automobile Driving Museum for hosting this year's event. For El Segundo Media, I'm Bill Thomas.